In this situation, we are being asked for the measure of angle theta in this triangle on the right side. But we don't have enough information to solve that triangle using the Sakatoa formulas. So we are forced to work with the triangle on the left to start with. In that triangle, we have the 48 degree angle and the 15 millimeter hypotenuse. And we can solve for the remaining angles and sides in this triangle. But the one that interests us is this side here that is adjacent to the 48 degree angle because that side is partially shared by the triangle on the right. This is a CAH situation, the CA formula. And we fill in our CA formula in this way. Cos of 48 degrees is equal to the adjacent X over hypotenuse 15. We plug the values into the formula and simplify and we get x equals 10.0370 millimeters if rounded off to four decimal places. That is not the same height as the upright side in the triangle on the right because the triangles are different sizes but we have been given the information that the difference between the two sides in the two triangles is two millimeters. So we just have to do a little addition 10.0370 plus 2 is equal to 12.0370 millimeters. Again, rounded off to four decimal places. Now we know the upright side and the triangle on the right, and we have enough information to solve. The upright is 12.0370, and the base is 16. It's a right triangle, and we are looking for angle theta. From angle theta's point of view, the two sides we know are the opposite and the adjacent, and this is a TOA situation, the TOA formula. We plug the values into the formula like this. Tan of unknown angle theta is equal to 12.0370 over 16. We simplify and we get theta is equal to 36.9545 degrees if rounded to four decimal places. But the question is asking us to round it to the nearest degree, so our final answer is angle theta is equal to 37 degrees. At all times when I'm working with these formulas, I take any value that is longer than four decimal places in my calculator, and I write it down to four decimal places on my paper. But I really use the full value and the memory of my calculator to avoid rounding off until I get to the final step. This makes my final answer more accurate. This is a multiple step Sokotoa situation.